Swamp milkweed grows in summer along Midwestern waterways, and it's a favorite target of aphids. Aphids are insect pests that quickly build enormous numbers to suck a plant's juices, and they often damage flower and garden plants. Aphids reproduce asexually without mating, and they give birth to live young, helping build their numbers at fantastic rates. If all conditions were just right, a single female aphid could lead to 600 billion aphids in just one growing season. But fortunately, lots of predators help keep their numbers in check, among them the pert and friendly little flower flies. These flies, known to entomologists as surfids, are ravenous aphid predators while in their larval state. They look like tiny green slugs, and they're good at hiding out. They often glue plant parts and aphid skins to their bodies for camouflage. Then they roam around looking for an aphid meal. Surfid larvae have a pair of hooks which they use to grasp and suck juices from their victims. They seize a living aphid and soon mangle and empty it, leaving only a hollow shell. When done, they quickly find another. After the larval stage, they rest in a pupal case on the flower for about a week. Then they emerge as adult flies ready to mate and lay eggs within another aphid colony. In time, together with other aphid predators, they can decimate an aphid population, a great example of biological control.